Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary position is Lee Dixon and we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. It's Spal and they take on Bologna. Well, let's take stock of the Spal starting eleven. Well, as a team, Lee, they love to apply almost suffocating pressure. Based on the lineup, do you expect the same approach today? Yeah, I think so, Derek. It makes it really difficult for the opponents to find their rhythm unless their touch is absolutely perfect. It forces mistakes, so I'd expect we'll be seeing plenty of that from them today. And the contest begins. And very deftly cut out. Medel. It's with Polly. Mitchell Dykes. Space and can he put it away? And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. Well, as we can see here, the defenders think they've got him under huge amounts of pressure, holds everybody off and still puts the ball in the back of the net. Well, let's have another view of that goal. One nil then. Yasmin Kurtic. Simone Misiroli. Well, couldn't keep it. Orsolini with it. Wonderful tackle. Counter attacking, very much an option. They failed to get it away properly and crossed in the direction of the back post. No shortage of excitement, level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, as we see, it's a great cross, but what a finish. So hard to wait and be patient when the ball's dropping. He does everything right and finishes it off. A brilliant goal. So, a level contest, 1-1. One, one. And that's an important intervention. And providing width. Teammates in the middle. He does have pressure to deal with. Crossing possibilities, foiling them effectively. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. And played in, and he was in the right place to intercept. It comes to absolutely nothing. The ball with Petania. It has to be! And somehow he prevents a goal. Well, it looked a certain goal, Derek. The agility, the reflex is unbelievable. And the short option preferred. Nicolas Sansone here. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Sansone. It's with Takahiro Tomoyasu. Getting forward. Pumps clear. Medel. It's with Poli. Will he play it in? Misiroli. 
D'Alessandro. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Marco D'Alessandro. He has time to play it over. Well, the header didn't exactly go to plan. Well, I'm not sure what he did there, but he caught it on the top of his head. But whatever he did, it was a poor attempt. Marco D'Alessandro. The ball with Petania. Missiroli. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. As teammates waiting inside the area. It had an invitation attached, but he couldn't avail himself of the opportunity. Well, just look at him. He thinks he's in just wide. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. Well, he's given it away. Yasmin Kurtic. Felipe. Murgia. Was certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. He has plenty of support. And he's taken it away. This attack looks highly promising. Clattered away. And possession. Excellent vision. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Over the touchline for a throw in. But strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. Promising sequence. Well, Derek, just look at those stats. Not created enough chances. They really haven't. They need to up the tempo, put the pressure on, then they should win this game. Alessandro Murgia. Francesco Vicari, D'Alessandro, and the referee is going to add on three minutes. Palacio in possession. And they are on the move again. Roberto Soriano. Now, can he deliver accurately? A very good tackle. So, the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Palacio in possession and a strong tackle. Paloski. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And options in the centre, foiling them effectively. Possession lost. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Haloski. Yasmin Kurtic. And won't they be able to play it in behind the defence? Well, the cross played over, but ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Excellent challenge. And he drills it in. And a powerful effort, but just lacking accuracy. Yeah, narrowly wide, Derek. Decent effort. He smashed it. Simone Misiroli. The ball with Mirko Valdifiori. Now they're on the scent of something positive. 
Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. On the ball, Roberto Soriano. On and on he goes. It's a cross towards the near post. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. He's found a pocket of space. And scope for the cross. Danger averted for now. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. A very attractive looking move. Easy on the eye, but nothing there. Misiroli. And Valdifiori. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. Into the advanced position. A deft clearance. Yasmin Kurtic. Well, the home fans are a little bit frustrated today. The team hasn't been at their best, but surely the quality will count in the end. And a substitution in the offing. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. And very deftly cut out. Paloski. The ball with Mirko Valdifiori. Paloski. Passing it with a bit of panache. And Valdifiori. Well, they have the ball in a very promising position, but now it's been taken away from them. Well, that is how to play advantage. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Inside the last quarter of an hour. Missiroli. Paloski. What can he do from here? He continues to make hay. Pulls it back. And this time, it's in! Stop the supply, you stop the goal. We learned that one at school, Derek. Poor defending here. Well, let's have another view of that goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1, the current state of affairs. On the ball, Roberto Soriano. Extremely sloppy in possession. Thunders clear. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And he's fired over the corner. Well, he had a decent reading of that ball in. Another corner. Corner kick played over. Well, it has come to nothing. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. And firing it into the area. The ball with Mirko Valdifiori. And the snuffing out of the cross there. And breaking at pace with Menace. Will they profit from this situation? Palacio in possession. Svanberg. Tommy Yasu. Getting forward. Teammates in the middle. Missiroli. And with your opponents bearing down on you, no wonder you want to just get rid of the ball. 
They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Svanberg. And on the ball, Danilo. And just the one minute left in normal time here. On and on he goes. It's with Takahiro Tomiyasu. Cross fired over. And they deal with the threat this time. And there it is, the final whistle.